Let's swing it. What's up, Money Geeks? Mr. V here. Welcome to another video, guys. So in today's video, we're going to talk about swing trading. But before we get started, guys, if you're new to the channel, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. So if that's something that interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. So swing trading, what is it? You, I mean, I've actually gotten these questions. People have asked me when I use it, um, either in comments and responding to people's uh, question or ask them if they are you know, looking to day trade or looking to swing trade or what kind of trader um, or what kind of trade strategy are they trying to implement? And people usually come back with the questions like, uh, what is swing trading? So basically swing trading is a situation where you buy a, a, a stock um, and hold it maybe overnight or maybe in a couple of days um, and sell it uh, for, for a profit or hope to sell it for a profit. That's basically what um, swing trading is. So um, again, the, the distinction with day trading is that you buy and sell the security that same day. Uh, whereas uh, swing trading, you buy and hold it um, overnight or hold it uh, a couple of days um, to sell it. And the reason why you would want to do that is because you have done some research about a particular stock. You know that that stock is either going to go up or it's going to go down. And that's the reason why you're buying it. So you probably say, but if the stock is going down, why am I buying it? Um, I'm going to do a separate video where I'll talk about uh, the strategy where you can buy when the price of the stock is going down. That is called short selling. So I'm going to talk about that in a separate video. But um, in this video, again, like I said, I want to um, talk to you guys my strategy for swing trading. So um, I do day trading uh, as well as swing trading. So on Weibo, I have a cash account that I use for swing trading and I have a margin account that I use uh, for day trading. Uh, my margin account has over 25K in it so I can do unlimited day trading, which is awesome. Uh, on the flip side, my, my cash account doesn't have that much money in it. So I do swing trading on that account. My goal is to eventually grow that account um, as much as I can. Uh, so in the account, what I'll do for my cash account is I'll look for opportunities and look for stocks. And here's the trick. With swing trading, you have to do a little bit of research, um, not just looking at that, you know, stocks that are gapping that I, I do for day trading. So for swing trading, you do some research. You have to know these companies, understand them, know what they, what products or service they provide. And it kind of, in some cases, read more in depth into their financials and listen to their earning calls. Um, they say, um, for me, I do a lot of earning calls and I use a service or I go to this website called um, Earning Whisperer. So you go to the website, it's gonna show you all um, the companies that are you know, have earnings this, like I said, this week, um, it will show you every single day which companies have their earnings call and when they have their earnings call. If it's uh, pre-market or it's after market close, it would show you there. And in that way, you can start researching those companies and, and do your strategy as to which one you want to go after. Uh, that's what I do. So if I go there, I see a company, I'll do some research figure out if the company is, you know, if their earnings are going to come out positive or it's going to come out negative. And then from there, you can decide and, and wait. Let's say pre-market, most of the calls would usually start around 7 um, a.m. Uh, central time or uh, 8 a.m. central time. That's before the market opens. So in that case, if you're listening to the call, um, I know a lot of people are probably thinking like, but why would I, why would I want to listen to this call? You have to listen to the call and see what or hear what the, the CEO or whoever is presenting says about. If there is excitement, there's some new uh, product that they're releasing or whatever, just based on the service that they provide. If there's something exciting that's gonna or their earnings, they 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 you know they beat their earnings and stuff like that. Then you know for sure that this company is uh, the, the stock is gonna pop as soon as the market opens. So in that case, now you take your pre-market. Uh, uh, you know, it, like in Weibo, you go pre-market buy. So you buy that stock and hold it. And then as soon as the market pops, you see that pop, that, that, that just jump into that squeeze and then you take your profit um, and then you get out. Or if you think that the squeeze is gonna keep going and then you just, as it rips, you just uh, continue to hold or you set kind of like a, a stop loss, take profit in Weibo, you set that and just follow and take as much profit 
as you can. So that's a good strategy for um, for you swing trading. Uh, likewise, if the call is after hours, so as soon as the market closes, that's when they have the call. You listen in with your order ready to go. As soon as you hear that excitement, it's good news, earnings, they beat their earnings and stuff like that, bam, you buy, you watch it rip. It, as soon as it rips, you, you, you just keep following it and take your profit as soon as possible. Don't be a greedy savage and think you want to take as much as you can. Take what is enough and let the rest go. Don't try to chase and take every single dime. That's when you run into trouble. Because as soon as that thing reverses, there's no stop. It goes down so quick that you are going to panic. You wouldn't even know which button to click on your, on your computer to sell. So trust me. So take profit and be happy with it. So if it goes up and you're up $200, secure that $200 because that's money that you didn't have a few minutes ago. And that's the, that's the reason why a lot of people lose money because they always want to go for the home run. And I don't want you to be that person. Again, like I said, don't be a greedy savage. So that is my strategy for swing trading. Um, another uh, a way that I go about doing swing trades is that I look for IPOs. So uh, if an IPO comes out, um, and, and again, a lot of people don't know about it. If I know that's an exciting uh, company, then I'll buy it and swing it. So I'll buy it and hold it maybe for a few days, maybe for a week or two. And then as soon as people start realizing what the company does and you know what you know how uh, profitable the company is looking, then people are going to jump in there. As it goes up, I take my profit and get out. So in this case, I'm not trying to buy it and hold it long term. I'm not looking at this company to be the next Tesla where it's going to go from $100 all the way to $2,300. No, that's not what I'm looking for. I'm just looking for my quick gain and I take my money and I get out. So again, two things here. I look at, I go to our Earning Whisper to get companies that have their earnings coming up. And then I also look for IPOs uh, and I do a lot of research about them. As soon as they open up, I buy and it, it, you know, kind of squeeze up, I take my profit and I'm out and I go to the next one. So that's exactly how I do it. And I do all of this in Weibo. So if you are looking to get started with investing and you don't know where to start, Weibo is definitely doing a promotion where if you sign up, you get two free stocks, not one, two, and you, when you deposit $100 in your account. So definitely check them out. I'm going to put the link in the description below. Uh, go check them out. Again, free is free. They're giving you two free stocks for nothing. So let me know in the comment section, what do you think about uh, swing trading? Are you are an active swing trader? I want to hear your strategy. How do you find the stocks that you swing? Um, and just got kind of share it with the community in the comment section below. YouTube tells me that 90% of you guys watching haven't already subscribed to my channel. So it would make my day if you can hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. Stay motivated.